Tracking your most accurate forecast, I'm meteorologist Jorge Torres, and the chance of rain and snow picking up now over the next couple of days across the state as we monitor a storm system that's going to dig farther to the south all the way through the weekend. So we're going to hold on to those rain and snow chances for at least several days. Thursday, much of Friday as well into Saturday and even through parts of St. Patty's Day on Sunday as that low just kind of meanders over Arizona through at least Monday and even into parts of Tuesday before gradually lifting up to the north and northeast for for several days. We're going to hold on to slight rain chances in the valley and snow chances up in the high country. In the meantime, rainfall amounts in the metro could be anywhere from a tenth to two tenths of an inch for mainly Thursday and Friday. So don't expect a wash up, but there is that chance for some slick roads here and there in the high country. Promising snow chances for a while with snowfall less estimates for Thursday and Friday in Flagstaff anywhere from four to eight inches of snow. And we'll see similar conditions as you head toward Williams forecasting four to six inches, three to five along the south rim of the Grand Canyon and generally one to three as you head along the rim uh, toward Heber and even Pine Top. Sholo forecasting maybe about an inch of snow and that's about it for at least the time being. But it will be a cool one too over the next few days with overnight lows staying in the 40s and 50s across the East Valley with highs tomorrow anywhere from 60 in Carefree to 67 in Scottsdale, 68 in Mesa and Gilbert too. And in the West Valley will keep overnight lows tonight down to the low to mid 40s with highs anywhere from 62 in Anthem to 66 in Deer Valley, 67 in Levine along with Goodyear as well. These highs 10 degrees below average for this time of year across northern Arizona tonight lows as cold as 20 there along the south rim along with Flagstaff 23 in Heber and 28 in Sholo and across the lower deserts will keep those overnight lows generally in the 40s to lower 50s including Lake Havasu City and Bullhead City too with highs tomorrow staying the 30s up in Flagstaff 40s in Heber and Sholo as well 50s in Payson and 60s across globe and southern parts of Gila County and throughout the lower terrain will keep those highs generally in the upper 60s to even lower 70s in a few locations including Yuma and in the old Pueblo. That seven day forecast showing temperatures staying right around 70 for the next couple of days with that chance for scattered showers and even an occasional thunderstorm around 30 percent holding on to isolated rain chances for Saturday, St. Patty's Day and Monday too. When temperatures slowly warming up we will be in the mid 70s by Sunday and Monday and back in the 80s with drier conditions early next week, but cooler for the next couple of days with decent rain chances Thursday and Friday.